Hello, ST Filmmaker here. While I think about how my phone made me disappear, I thought I'd take the time to test a new product. Not many people know this, but ever since I was a kid, I was known as a severely picky eater. However, at one point in my life, it's gotten to the point where I refused to eat anything. To make sure my body was at least at the nutritional level, I was prescribed this stuff. And sure, a milkshake-like meal replacement, which was chock full of various nutrients to keep me at least healthy. I grew up in the 90s, so this kid-friendly counterpart pediatrician wasn't invented yet. Meaning, in order for me to get this prescribed to me at least, I had to get an okay from the doctor in order to get it. Nowadays, I rarely drink this stuff and, ex and experiment with it by making protein shakes. However, now I found something that may make Insure look like candy in comparison. This is Rumble, a new type of drink that's supposedly a mix between a meal replacement and an energy drink. I first saw it on Dragon's Den, where it was actually approved by the Dragons, an organization of investors who pass the time deciding which products are worth investing money into. The Rumble team had a very interesting story behind their product that touched my heart. Rumble was created by Paul Underhill of British Columbia, Canada. He suffered from a disease in his lung that required him to literally keep his body healthy. Rather than rely on this shit, the man made his own product with the help of his team. It was the very drink he created that not only kept him healthy, but kept him alive long enough to get transplanted. Meaning this drink saved his life, and he wants to share it with the rest of us. The ingredients are as shown. Purified water, milk protein concentrate, calcium, whey protein, organic maple syrup, organic tapioca dextrin, inulin, organic flaxseed oil, Organic agave nectar, Dutch cocoa, organic pumpkin seed oil, natural flavor, cellulose gel, organic vanilla bean extract, green tea extract, cellulose gum, potassium carbonate, carrageenan, mahogany extract, organic cherry, black currant, red beet juice, concentrate, kale, organic spinach, stevia, leaf extract, and a lot of other milk ingredients. Holy shit, this is mostly stuff alone I wouldn't bring to save my life. Now, Rumble comes in two flavors. The one I got is Dutch Cocoa, and the other one's called Vanilla Maple. The... So without further ado, I should do this try. See if the dragons are right. Oh, I got just put the book on this. Strong, but it's got a good taste to it. The dragons are jerks, and sometimes they get one right on the money. <laughs> I can taste the cocoa, but only for a brief second, but it feels like a strong, really, really strong taste. I might try vanilla maple next time, but until then, I got a lot of more of these to go. Under Hill, you're a genius. As usual, debate, argue, let me know what it is. Stay tuned for more. Why don't you just start 69? Oh, I never thought of that.
Hello? Who's this? I was just about to ask you the same question. This is SD Phone Maker. That's impossible. Oh, well, why is that? Because you shouldn't be able to call me. What are you talking about? Because, ST, you're not real. <laughs>